This is so much fun, guys. I wish I had this in my backyard. Good morning. Well, good afternoon. It's currently 12.05. It is Wednesday, May 31st. I couldn't remember what day it was. Um, we are currently getting dressed. Dad or daddy? Hello. We are currently getting ready to go pick up the U-Haul to pack up and move. So, come along. Good time now, and I think until Monday to be able to move. So, let's go get the U-Haul. We'll upload to the shorts are from Target. Little bit of We just picked up the U-Haul. My dad is currently driving it back to the house because I am too scared to drive it. And then it's time to start packing it up. I probably look like a horrible hot sweaty mess right now, but we just finished packing up the truck Ow. at my parents' house. They have like a big um, shop and I had a bunch of stuff in storage. And now we, woo, now we are headed to my house to finish packing up the little bit of stuff that I have left over there. All I can say right now is moving in the beginning of summer is probably not the best idea. It is hot and I also live in the south. So right now it is currently 82 which is honestly not bad for May 31st. It's actually very cool. It's normally in the 90s by now but going in and out of a storage shed and packing up boxes is very hot. guys it is Thursday June 1st 5.01 a.m. and it is officially moving day but it's still currently pitch black outside
large Dr. Pepper, a large mocha frappe. We can't do frappe at the moment. We gotta fix the machine. Okay, a little update. We are about halfway there. Um, it's currently 7.31. Can you say hey? Um, so y'all heard them tell me earlier that their frappe machine was down at McDonald's. So we stopped another one just now. I got a sausage burrito and I got a mocha frappe. many hours later what is up guys um so i know it's a little bit of change of scenery since the last time we talked at like what seven o'clock this morning um so what happened was my camera died and it has been so hectic that i'm not even wanting to charge it so i'm currently filming on my phone it's probably really bad quality, but I'm currently eating my first meal. And I door dashed it, or Uber, Uber eats it. Uh, Mason is currently in the bathtub. It is 10:01, and. It's alright. I know I'm tired. Thankfully, my mom comes into town tomorrow uh, and can help because it's been rough. Also, dilemma. Mm -hmm. So, I texted my dad this morning when I left at 5 o'clock because I didn't want to wake him up. I didn't want to call him. But, like, yo. So I texted him and was like, hey, can you pick up my suitcases that I left in the garage? They would not fit in my car. Thinking, you know, he'd see it when he woke up. Didn't see it. And all my clothes were in those two suitcases. So. Now I have to wait till tomorrow for clothes. I also forgot a whole entire box that had all my bedding in it. So I literally have no bedding. I have a mattress and a bed frame in there. And that's it. So it's been a day. I'll give you a little halfway tour because let me tell you, it's bad. It's real bad. So you walk in right here. I already got my ring doorbell set up. I walk in. That is laundry room, mechanical closet. This is your first coat closet. Excuse all the boxes. This has like a little barn door thing. And that goes to Mason's like side of the apartment. His bathroom. His room is the only one that is like decently halfway set up and then you come out of this hallway this is the second cut closet and this will be the living room um dining room kitchen a whole hot mess i know and then that is a pantry right there and then off of that is my bedroom and I have a bed frame and a mattress with no sheets. And then a closet. And it's actually huge to be an apartment closet. So, I'm a fan. And then my bathroom. Let's just say, like, I'm over it. I never want to move ever again. It is terrible. I understand why people hire movers now because this is not fun. Like, unloading all those boxes from a U Haul was the worst time of my life. That's a little dramatic. But also, 
it rained like three times. So I get here, and the only thing they don't have, like, it's great. I love this apartment complex. The only thing they don't have is the, like, grocery carts to, like, get your groceries in. And I was banking on that to, like, bring up bags and stuff that I had packed in my car. So we went to Walmart and got one of those, like, rolly cart things to be able to, like, one, bring groceries up, but, like, two, bring all the bags up. And my phone case completely broke in Walmart and my phone like fell out of it so I had to buy a little Walmart phone case which actually very cute very very cute so yeah it is 10 o'clock and I'm exhausted I'm running on two hours of sleep He's driving me nuts. It's been a long day. A long last two days. So I'm going to probably sleep with him tonight in his bed since I left all my bedding at home. My mom and my best friend are coming in town tomorrow. So fingers crossed, like, we get this is settled because your grandma needs to go in the grocery store too. I have nothing. Not actually, that's a lie. I got Capri Suds. But that's it. Hopefully we can get all this done tomorrow so that we can maybe go to the grocery store tomorrow. Maybe not. But definitely go to the grocery store before the weekend's over. Because I'm just uber eating. I don't even know how much to spend on this either. I just hit order because I was starving. Good morning and welcome to day two. I'm exhausted. My whole body hurts. But let's get this show on the road. They just delivered my IKEA furniture. I'm currently using my window sill as a tripod because that camera is still dead. Still don't know where I put the charger. Mason is still asleep. That's the truck leaving. But let's show you what I got. So they delivered this beauty love it and all of this so yay now mm -hmm. time to put it together i've been feeling so small watch the clock ticking off the wall car.